one day somebody does something unspeakable to someone else, to someone you hardly knew, man, you do something about it because you can. From NBC Washington, we get this story where a grand jury has indicted a Bowie, Maryland police officer on a charge of attempted murder for firing his gun at a man on a busy road last month. About 8 a.m. on September 12th, Sergeant Robert Warrington stopped on Collington Road near Route 50 to check on a white SUV parked on the side of the road. A man who asked to remain unidentified told News 4 he was trying to retrieve his hat that had blown away while his girlfriend and children remained in the SUV. As the man walked past Warrington on his way back to the SUV, he appeared to have one hand over his stomach, he's probably holding the hat, with the other hand holding a white cloth or T-shirt that appeared to have blood on it. Now, Warrington asked, are you here to help her? The man said, no, she's taking me to the hospital. Let's go to the hospital. Moments later, Sergeant Warrington fired a shot. And then he, quote, he's yelling at somebody. He had a gun. He had a gun. The man says, I don't have a gun. The woman is screaming. What did you do? What did you do? What did you do? Why did you do that? Why? And the cop says, Sergeant Warrington says, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. The gunshot hit a passing minivan. Luckily, no one was injured. Now, that, that was the scene, okay? September 12th, 8 o'clock in the morning. That white SUV was parked on the side of the road. Uh, the man's girlfriend and children were in that vehicle. He says he'd gotten out uh, to go and retrieve a hat that was on the side of the road. Now, we spoke to him. News Force Darcy Spencer spoke to him within days of when this happened. Here's what he had to say. I thought I died on that highway. You thought you were hit by this gunfire? Yes. I it, as soon as my ear stopped ringing, I turned around and asked the officer, why did he shoot me? He said he instinctively pulled out his phone to try to capture the shocking encounter. There you go. Start recording the cops. Quote, the video that was provided by the Bowie City Police Department, it speaks for itself, says Prince George's County State's Attorney, Aisha Braveboy. She goes on, the actions were not in line with the training or the orders of the Bowie City Police Department. That's from the state's attorney. Police Chief Dane Dwayne Preston issued a statement that reads in part, I support the grand jury's independent objective process. Sergeant Warrington will be suspended without pay. Now, Sergeant Warrington is a 12-year veteran of the Bowie Police Department. He faces charges including attempted second-degree murder and reckless endangerment. So they're not even going manslaughter. They're going second-degree murder because, you know, attempted murder. I'm sorry. Second-degree attempted murder because he shot at this guy. Uh, but the thing is, 12-year veteran of the police department and sergeant. And he just shoots at this guy. Why? You know, how many times has this guy recklessly endangered somebody's life or even injured somebody and then just wrote it in his report and narrative? Oh, well, yeah. Um, you know. And And his guilt comes out. There was something. I don't know if you guys caught it. But his guilt came out with one particular phrase he said I'm sorry I'm sorry I'm sorry he knew he was wrong he's apologizing he said I'm sorry I'm sorry I'm sorry he already knew he was wrong he knew he was wrong before that that first bang he knew he was wrong that's why he's saying sorry because a police officer that thought he did the right thing wouldn't be going I'm sorry I'm sorry he'd be like hey get on the ground or whatever right 
So if you didn't catch that, him saying I'm sorry over and over, this guy needs to go to prison.